This is my wife's brand new 2022 Acura MDX with the tech package. And this is the third time that the vehicle has died in three weeks of ownership, of which we have only had it in our possession about 12 days. Um, we took, took possession of the car, delivery of the car on December 30th, 2021. And the same evening, went to go out and run an errand. And when we went to start the car, the infotainment screen did not turn on. The backup camera still worked, but nothing else worked. Uh, so the audio didn't work and you couldn't access any of the controls for the car in there. Uh, the rest of the car functioned fine. So we drove the car, parked it that night. And then the next morning, the car was dead, Bet dead battery. Uh, so had the car towed back to uh, the dealer and uh, they said, oh, it's no problem. It just had a bad battery in it. It didn't have enough power to turn the screen on. We put a new battery in it, it's all good. So we took took the car back on about day five, I think it was, and uh, same evening, went to run an errand. Screen didn't turn on. Parked the car that night, next morning, car's dead, again. So called roadside assistance again, had the car back to the dealer again. Car was then there a week, and they said, no, it's all good, we're gonna replace the uh, control module for the infotainment. So they did that and they said, yeah, car is good to go. So we took the car back a second time and the next morning went to go somewhere, screen didn't turn on. And they said, oh, don't, don't worry about it. You might have to just let the car warm up for five minutes before the screen turns on. That didn't work. Uh, they said, oh, well, you might have to turn the car back off and back on again for it to turn on. No, that, that didn't work. So the battery drain issue appeared to be fixed the second time and it lasted about a week. And then this morning we went to go to work and the car's dead because the screen's been off pretty much most of the time that we've driven it for the last week. It's a temperature related issue. So uh, anywhere below minus 10 Celsius is when the screen doesn't work. And then as, if you shut the car off with the screen off, it will drain the battery. If the screen happens to come on while you're out driving or turn the car off and on and you shut it off with the screen working, it's all good. It won't drain the battery, but with the screen off, it does drain the battery. So this is the third time now. And so the tow truck will be here soon to tow our brand new 2022 Acura MDX tech package back to the dealer. And just to add to that, so after the third time the screen didn't work, uh, we had the feeling that the dealer was giving us the runaround, so we called Acura Canada, and they said, uh, oh yeah, that's a known issue, and there's no fix for it. Uh, sorry, talk to your dealer. And uh, yeah, there's nothing we're going to do for you, so talk to them, and uh, they, they'll they take the car back if it's within 30 days of the purchase. Click. And uh, so that's what led to us having negotiations with the dealer now. Um, so what I surmise from that is that Acura and the dealers are knowingly selling defective cars and not informing consumers. So there you go.